So here we go. We've got about another half an hour before sunset. And it's going to be an epic one. I was always the guy on trips that would be taking everybody's photo. I just kept growing with it until the last uh, 10 years. I've just basically decided to make it uh, my career. I think my favorite part of shooting at night is actually being out there alone, just by myself with my camera, hopefully being a little bit warm, and just watching the universe unfold before me. It's just, it's just magical. And as long as I hear two go in a row, it should keep working. We're good. One camera down. My name is David McComb, and right now we're at the peak of Whistler and we're enjoying a beautiful sunset. A night sky is to follow, which is gonna be epic. Get ready for that. And uh, yeah, we're just here for a great night. I think I'm just driven by the beauty of the night sky. And at the end of the day, I also wanna create something. I wanna do it for my kids, for my family, for myself. I just feel this drive inside to create and in my own little way, I hope I'm doing that. I really love getting those big pictures of Worcester Blackcomb, uh, the sunsets, the night sky. Um, and to that end, for the last few years, I've been leading um, uh, Alpine photography tours in July and August to the peak of Whistler and uh, I enjoy that like you can't imagine. We, every time we come up here with a group we see something different. I just love seeing the look in people's faces when they come down off the mountain and they've seen a sunset from the Alpine because nothing beats a sunset from the Whistler Alpine. They're just blown away and many times I've heard things like this is the favorite part of their experience in Whistler, just experiencing a, uh, a sunset from up here. My advice for somebody wanting to get into night sky photography is simply get a, a camera that you can control a bit, learn how to use it, get a good tripod, and then get out there. And uh, don't be afraid to be out there in the dark. There's, you're not going to get hurt. There's lots of safe places right on the edge of Worcester, on the lakes, or anywhere. Yeah, this is going to be a good time lapse. We got the Milky Way right in front of us, the snow banks on either side, and uh, everything's going to move to frame right. Yeah, let's do it. This place inspires. The, the people here are just amazing. They, they're, they're creative, they're, they're passionate, they're driven. And I love being around people like that. And that's what brought me to Worcester in the first place, as well as the snow and the mountains and the in environment. But these landscapes just go on and on. They're always changing, but I always find something different to shoot in them. I never get bored about shooting here. In fact, I could be shooting here for the rest of my life and uh, I'd enjoy it. 